Trojans. Today is Wednesday, August 31st, and it's a B-Day. I'm Max Bloom. And I'm Maxwell Brown. Today's quote is from Gilda Radner, a comedian and Emmy Award winning actress. Quote, life is about not knowing, having to change, taking the moment, and making the best of it. Unquote. Tomorrow's football game is against Santa Rosa. The theme is life in college. Kickoff is at 7 p.m. Come and represent. Football started off with a spark. While the Trojans beat Terran Linda 41-21, there was other excitement happening off the field. For those who may not know, an electrical problem last Friday during the game led people to be evacuated from the home side bleachers twice. Nobody was hurt and the game continued. We want to thank Petaluma firefighters and the police for their quick response to help with the problem. Interested in helping rebuild our GSA club? The Genders and Sexualities Alliance welcomes students and staff across the LGBTQ community as well as allies and serves as both a safe place and an organization for social impact. See Ms. Redfield in A2 or email her at jredfield at peke12.org if you would like to help lead and organize this club for our Trojan community. A guest to the homecoming dance on Saturday, September 24th who doesn't go to Petaluma High? If you do, now is the time to get that guest paperwork. Stop by D1 at break or lunch to pick up that paperwork. You and your guests must complete it and turn it in no later than Wednesday, September 21st. It's a process, so start it early. All paperwork must be turned in in order for you to buy you and your guests dance tickets. Swim conditioning is happening at the PHS pool from 335 to 445 every Tuesday and Thursday. Swim coaches will be present, but only to supervise. All new students will need to complete a quick lap across the pool to demonstrate their skills and abilities. Want to get a good workout in? Come to the open pool, which is open to everybody. Don't forget your suit, your towel, and your goggles. Do you See know you what soon. BSA stands for? It's the Bilingual Student Ambassadors, and they are here to help families who need help with translation at school events. If you are interested, there's a meeting in C8 at lunch tomorrow. Go check it out. If you can't go to tomorrow's meeting, you can go next Thursday, September 8th. Our What to Do If segment on Monday was cut off. Our apologies for that. Here's the full information on what to do if you lose something while on campus. The Lost and Found Department is located here in the main office. Valuable items are always kept in a safe location. If you've lost a book, it might be returned to the library or a teacher. If you lost something in the locker room, there's, there's a Lost and Found found here in the PE locker room. Please support the Petaluma High music program by participating in the Dine and Donate at Lombardi's Gourmet Deli and Barbecue tomorrow from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. No flyer is needed. Just tell them that you are supporting Petaluma High music when you purchase your food. If you can't participate in the Dine and Donate, but you would like to directly donate to the PHS music program, you can by scanning this QR code, which will link you to a site where you can donate with a credit card or e-check to the Petaluma High School Music Boosters. We hope you will consider donating to help support the students' musicians at Petaluma High. What do Serena Williams, Steffi Graf, Monica Seles, and Billie Jean King all have in common? They were all amazing tennis players. If you're interested in playing on the PHS girls tennis team, then you're in luck. You can still come and play on the team. Come to PHS tennis courts after school this week and check it out. All are welcome. That's it for today's program. Stay safe out there, Trojans, and make, make it a, a great, great day. day.